And the church, the Presbyterian church, is growing tremendously. The largest Presbyterian church in the world is situated in Seoul. It is 70,000 members. Every day, for uh, every, every day of the, of the year, they have four prayer services. I went to the one at 6 o'clock in the morning, and they have three others in the morning. And 2,000 people showed up to pray. And I thought about the Macedonian churches that the very first thing that they did is that they gave themselves to the Lord. Now, I would imagine that they prayed, and I would imagine that they planned, and I would imagine also that they proclaimed God's goodness in their lives. Because one of the things that Paul says is we understand that their stands was very important to Paul. Because their stance was part of his teaching to the Corinthians. Their liberality was something that the Corinthians needed to hear at that time. I learned also in South Korea that legacy giving is so important. Maybe you've heard the name Louis Severance. He was a great philanthropist in Cleveland, Ohio. You will find that a lot of those uh, theater um, houses and a lot of the things that Cleveland really depends upon was given by the servant's family. Horton Allen was the first medical missionary from the Presbyterian Church to South Korea. And on furlough, he went back to Cleveland, Ohio, and he was given a presentation on how bleak and depleted the medical resources in South Korea at that time, Korea was. And Louis Severance was in that group of people. And he went up to uh, Dr. Allen and he said, I want to give you a million dollars to start a hospital. Severance never set foot in Korea. But he said this. He said, you are no happier to receive it than I am to give it. And that Severance Hospital, 135 years later, is one of the most important hospitals in South Korea. In fact, in all of Asia. Because people come there for cancer treatment. It has a great pediatrics department. It is well known throughout Asia of its capable doctors and it remains Christian. And they are indebted to the Presbyterian Church USA to begin that work. That, my friends, is legacy given. Can you pray about that? What type of legacy is God asking you to make? How much impact will the next hundred years have in Salem because you gave like Louis Seven. 